It is Memorial Day weekend. Thanks so much for joining us, everyone. I'm Rod Carter. Angela's off tonight. This weekend marks the unofficial start of summer and the first big, real post pandemic holiday. We have live team coverage for you tonight. We're going to start with CBS 17's Imani Payne live in Raleigh. Imani? Yeah, the weather hasn't slowed down much out here. As you can see, people are still finding their way down here to Glenwood South to get a jump start on the holiday and summer they say they missed out on one year ago. Memorial Day weekend, the first major holiday since the easing of restrictions, bringing many people to downtown Raleigh despite the weather. Bars and restaurants thankful for the extra foot traffic following a rough year. Flight, I mean, if you would take it today, versus last year at this time. I mean, literally night and day. But right now, they got the streets packed. And we're loving it. Still, the relaxed guidelines for mask and indoor-outdoor gathering downtown will take some getting used to. Yeah, it, feel, it feels weird, um, but again, we're trying to get back to normal. Um, taking it step by step. It feels great to be out. You know, it feels great to actually see people enjoying themselves. Police seen out patrolling, making sure things remain safe. People saying they're testing the waters getting out now to gauge how the rest of their summer will go. It feels like um, I'm coming out of hibernation almost, but it's nice to see faces and glad that everyone, you know, is getting vaccinated and able to hang out again. And again, while police have been out patrolling, things have remained under control so far. For now, we're live in Raleigh, Imani Payne, CBS 17 News. All right, Imani, thank you.